Hi, it's Journey. I just wanted to come on here real quick since it's been a while since I've made a video and I wanted to share a couple of herb crafts that I've been doing. These are some of the oils I started. I have comfrey, plantain oil, St. John's wort, and mugwort. These are all herbs from my garden that I put in olive oil. I'm going to let them steep for six weeks. Unfortunately, my vervain oil was moldy this morning, so I have to start all over. Oh well, it happens sometimes. I don't know why the herbs were not exposed on the top. They got moldy anyway. Maybe they were just too... I don't know, they weren't wet when I put them in there. Maybe they were just... I have no idea. <laughs> And then I got um, a couple of sweet grass braids that I made. These smell so good. I, I have a sweet grass in my garden as well. And then there's my little dream pillow I made. You can't really tell, but uh, yes, you can. The fabric is sparkly and glittery. Smells very good. I made this outer case, and the inside I have a muffin bag where I put all the herbs in. So that way the outer cover is washable. I put different blends in there, and I got the recipe from this book, Making Herbal Dream Pillows, by Jim Long. I just book for a while. Has some really nice recipes in it. And for this pillow, I used the Pleasant Dreams recipe. It calls for mugwort, rose petals, chamomile, lavender flowers, catnip, and mint. And my cats seem to love this very much. <laughs> I have to hide it from them because they seem to think I made it for them. So, yeah, this is my dream pillow. There's my sweet grass braids. Some oils. I'm going to do some colandula oil, colandula, whatever you want to call it. And, uh,. Well, that's it for today thank you so much for watching and thank you for being a subscriber i do appreciate you very much and until the next time blessings